be alone, that is the secret of invention, be alone, that is when ideas are born. If your hate could be turned into electricity, it would light up the whole world. My brain is only a receiver, in the universe there is a core from which we obtain knowledge, strength and inspiration. I have not penetrated into the secrets of this core, but I know that it exists. The day science begins to study non-physical phenomena, it will make more progress in one decade than in all the previous centuries of its existence. What we now want is closer contact and better understanding between individuals and communities all over the earth, and the elimination of egoism, and pride which is always prone to plunge the world into primeval barbarism and strife. Peace can only come as a natural consequence of universal enlightenment. Everyone should consider his body as a priceless gift from one whom he loves above all, a marvelous work of art, of indescribable beauty, and mystery beyond human conception, and so delicate that a word, a breath, a look, nay, a thought may injure it. I do not think there is any thrill that can go through the human heart like that felt by the inventor as he sees some creation of the brain unfolding to success. Such emotions make a man forget food, sleep, friends, love, everything. Let the future tell the truth, and evaluate each one according to his work and accomplishments. The present is theirs, the future, for which I have really worked, is mine. Most persons are so absorbed in the contemplation of the outside world that they are wholly oblivious to what is passing on within themselves. Invention is the most important product of man's creative brain. The ultimate purpose is the complete mastery of mind over the material world, the harnessing of human nature to human needs. One must be sane to think clearly, but one can think deeply and be quite insane. Life is and will ever remain an equation incapable of solution, but it contains certain known factors. What one man calls God, another calls the laws of physics. If you only knew the magnificence of the three, six and nine, then you would have the key to the universe. Of all things, I liked books best. The present is theirs, the future, for which I really worked, is mine. I do not think you can name many great inventions that have been made by married men. We crave for new sensations but soon become indifferent to them. The wonders of yesterday are today common occurrences. Thank you so much everybody for watching. I really hope you like this new style of videos we started creating. Please feel free and let us know in the comments below, what you liked and what you didn't like. Also, let us know what you would like to see next. See you next time.